Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today we're going to be ranking Battle Pass outfits, the worst from every season. So we're going to know off season two. Um, season two was the first ever Battle Pass. Um, it only had 70 tiers. Um, for that sake, we only had four skins. We had Black Knight or Sparkle Specialist. Definitely not going to beat them. Some of the greatest skins ever to be introduced early to Fortnite. Um, so that leaves us with Blue Squire and Royal Knight. Um, although Blue Squire is very bad, uh, it has to go to Royal Knight. But uh, nothing right. Everything wrong. Like, if you want a knight outfit, I would go for Blue Squire, not the Royal Knight, or Black Knight, or Red Knight, got Red Knight as well, or Ultimate Knight actually now. Um, yeah. Anyway, Season 3. So in Season 3, it was the first Battle Pass to have 100 tiers. So at the beginning we had Mission Specialist, alright skin, not the best. Then we had Rust Lord, pretty okay skin. Then we had Moonwalker. Then we had Dark Voyager, then Elite Agent, then Reaper for the T100. Um, gotta say, this has to go to Moonwalker. Done nothing right. Tried to make a female version of Mission Specialist. It completely failed. Bad skin. If you rock it, what are you doing? What are you doing? Right, season four. We had a lot of good outfits in season four. Like the carbide, Omega. I say Zoe's alright, don't really mind the valor. So that leaves us with Battlehawk, Technique Squad Leader. Battlehawk, really alright skin. Squad Leader, pretty basic for the last skin before the tier 100. Omega, but it's not as bad as Technique. What are you doing with Technique? I mean, like, she fits in with the storyline with the spray paints, but who would use Technique? I mean, like, Tilt the Technique, Season 10 recreated. It's not a good skin, but it's way better than Technique. When I say way, I mean way better. Anyway, Season 5, there was a lot of good skins, like Drift, um, Ragnarok, Rook, Redline, Sunstrike is an alright skin, and that leaves us with Sledgehammer, Sledgehammer is a good skin, but Huntress is not, Huntress is a bad skin, she fits in with Viking themed, but she does not work as a skin. Who would use Huntress? Honestly, who would use her? Anyway, moving on to season six. There's a lot of alright skins like Dyer, DJ Yonder, Fable and Dusk. They're alright skins. The bad skin of the season is DJ Yonder and Nightshade. Calamity is the best. And Nightshade is the worst. They tried to remake Tomato Head. Tomato Head is an extremely bad skin. Although Nightshade done it better than Tomato Head. Just horrible. Horrible. Anyway, moving on to season 7. I think we all know who this is going to. Zenith. Who would use them? Legendary outfits. Should be one of the default skins. Horrible skin. It makes me throw up when I see it. Alongside Zenith, we had a quite good battle pass season 7. I mean, onesie's alright, but. Right, season 8. A lot. Of goodness and badness in season eight. The two two bad skins, Sidewinder and Lux. The two brilliant skins 
Cry Brown Black Cop. And the and sorry, um, Peely as well. Love to Peely. Got say, Lux. Lux is an all right skin. It's where she was. T one hundred. She's an all right skin though. That's like there's a sidewinder. Oh my god. Try to make a female Indiana Jones. Epic Games. You failed. Big time. Right, season 9. We had Bad Skins in season 9. Stratus, Bunker Jonesy, Vega, Vida, whatever you say, um, and Sentinel. Horrible skins. There are some good skins in the season, like Demi, Rocks, and Vendetta. It goes to Vega. Oh my god. Why would you put this on an epic skin? It doesn't even deserve for a battle pass. Why epic games? Why? Season 10. I think you guys all know already. Georgia Technique. Not much I can say now. Chapter 2, Season 1. You all know who it's going to be. Tuck. Oh my god. How bad of a skin is Tuck? Journey was a close second, but Tuck. Yup. Chapter 2, Season 2, the season we're on now. It's very hard to judge on this season. But the last one is Brita. Yes. Who would put Tattoo Llama on the back of their head? What the? Anyway, that's the season of our list for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. To see if we can get this video to 10 likes. Um, subscribe to the channel if you if you want to get notifications as well. If you subscribe, you can only subscribe and turn on notifications. You can't just turn on notifications and not subscribe. Turn notifications when you all want to be subscribed. So you get all notifications. Then you can go see Joshua's Bye.